Okay. So your mic is off. So please turn on your mic. Mr. Alan Porter, click on the mic. Okay. Can you hear me now? All right. Okay. Now you can I'll speak. St I'll start again. Sorry about that. <laughs> I don't know why it goes off because I haven't touched it. Anyway, as, right. you, um, as I was saying, that I am from the UK or Great Britain, as you may refer to. Uh, but United Kingdom seems to be the popular name now. And I live right in the centre of the UK in England. Um, I am retired now, um, as you can probably gather from my age. I've, uh, I, although I'm from the UK, I now live in Spain. And when I retired 12 years ago, I moved to Spain to the province of Andalusia. But I, my profession was really in the water industry, um, building mechanical engineering services. And having worked in the industry probably for 30 years, I went into teaching and I've been teaching my profession for the last 30 years before I retired. And now, of course, I'm just taking life easy. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. And uh, we request all the members to be here until this live discussion is get over. So let's kick the ball rolling at this moment. So directly without any formal or informal discussion, we are moving on to the live discussion topic that is mathematics in our everyday life. So dear brothers and sisters, today we are speaking much more about mathematics. You know, here in India, there was a great mathematician. His name was C.V. Raman. He had found a lot of mathematical, uh, mathematical discoveries, inventions in his life. And he was a Nobel Prize winner too. You know, mathematics is very important and it plays a crucial role in our life. Banking and education, our daily calculation, everywhere. So mathematics is inevitable in our life. So dear brothers and sisters, now it's your turn to speak more about this particular topic. One condition, you have to speak only one minute, maximum one minute. And uh, uh, here your names will be called. After that, you can start speaking. So please be here just turning on your camera because this is a video conference, not audio classroom. So I request every Zoom participants to be here with their camera on. Firstly, let me call upon Mr. Arish from India. Very happily, I invite Mr. Arish to speak about this topic. Okay, thank you so much, Mr. Coach. Well, first of all, I would like to thank for all being here and uh, hardly I uh, just uh, thank to Mr. Coach who gave me this opportunity. Well, according to today's topic, I'm going to uh, give you some tips about uh, mathematics. And firstly, I would like to share some information about its uses. Everyone knows mathematics plays a big role in our life because if uh, if we want to do anything, it will start from our mathematical calculations, mathematical estimations, and mathematical formulas. Let's suppose you are working as an engineer. 
in a construction site then you have to measure all the aspects with your scaling rollers and with the help of all other parameters that are used to measure any particular thing so mathematics is always useful for us to perform our activities as well as it is also an important tool for study and uh, it is already uh, you know it is something crucial for everyone because we all are participated in our uh, qualifications what we are pursuing and what we are chasing so every uh, everywhere you will get mathematics so mathematics is so easy to learn and mathematics is uh, is a compulsory thing for everyone so everyone has to uh, read about that and everyone has to study about it and uh, by all these uh, uh, ex uh, exercises and uh, all things we are capable to know the importance of mathematics in our daily life so basically <clears throat> thank you very much mr mohammad arish due to time limit we are moving on to another personality here so let's respectfully and cordially welcome mr mr alan porter from from uk sir you can start speaking about mathematics in our daily life sir your mic is mute i think sir your mic is mute sir your mic is mute sir please click on the mic sir sorry for reminding you okay I don't right. know why it keeps doing that. Uh, I'm not switching it off. I leave it on. Never mind. Um, yes, in my profession, um, in the latter part, was dealing with uh, heating engineers who install gas and oil-fired boilers. And, of course, in that field, there's a lot of mathematics. Um, we need to uh, calculate uh, pipe sizes, uh, gas pressures, oil pressures, etc. Um, uh, even the, the, the sighting of oil tanks want not to uh, calculate various distances that you could install an oil tank, if you like, for safety reasons. Um, and of course, the other problem, not a problem, but during my teaching period, we went from the imperial system to metric. And uh, in many ways, the metric system was a little bit easier than the old imperial system. So it wasn't too bad to get a grasp of uh, kilograms rather than pounds, uh, etc. <laughs> Just to give you an example. But also, um, now I'm retired, I'm working now with a different currency, the euro. And of course, I need to get a grip of uh, the, the finances here with banking, etc. That's the most important as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I need to be able to uh, work out uh, my finances by looking at my bank statement, um, etc. But really, th th that's, the, that's where mathematics comes in for me now that I'm retired. But um, I was never actually brilliant at mathematics, but uh, I I've had to make myself, you know, come up to date with, with, with the new system, with, with the metric system. So that's it for me. Okay. All right. Thank you very much for giving us a short introduction or brief description about uh, mathematics in our day-to-day -day life. You know, in India, particularly, we celebrate Mathematics Day. Uh, you know, National Mathematics Day. That is, uh, we celebrate here every December 22. So, you know, 
uh, in commemorance of Sivi Raman. Mm -hmm. Sivi Raman or uh, uh, Jasimuddin, is it correct? Sivi Raman or is it is it is it okay? Maybe sir, I, feel I don't know. Ramadan. You know, C CV Raman, the full form of CV Srinivasa Ramanujan. So you yes, know, sir, you he, he, right. he built a particular uh, space in mathematics. So that's why um, his all contribution towards mathematics was still uh, by hearted by uh, little hearts in primary, upper primary, even in college students. So there are a lot of mathematical equations created by C.V. Raman. So we honorably or we, with full of respect, we, we, we honor and we, we remember or we commemorate his memories and his contribution towards our nation. So thank you, Mr. Alan Porter, for sharing your views about this, this wonderful topic. Now, let's call Mr. Some people turned off their camera, so I am unable to call their names. So if you open your camera, this would be a wonderful session. And, you know, this would be a face-to-face -face video conference as given on the title in the in the in the zoom link everything has clearly given just like a general discussion you just go and check the link not simply a link but you will see everything topic separately time as per indian time or the time and the date and general instructions everything is given on the link so please be polite and respectful towards uh, Gesto International. You know, we provide excellent uh, training programs worldwide. So here, this is uh, an outstanding, you know, this is, this is a, a fabulous opportunity for you to speak to different people around the world. Normally, we have 30, 40 members, but I don't know what happened to members maybe their hectic schedule so no problem let's invite mr mr jasimuddin thank you very much sir for giving me opportunity to talk about my activity uh, my name is jasimuddin i'm from bangladesh and uh, mathematics is uh, very important for our life. Uh, whatever we do, uh, most of the things uh, we do like mathematics, uh, uh, everybody needs uh, uh, some basic math uh, to, uh, to lead their life. Uh, first. And uh, like uh, if we, I will give one example about mathematics, like, like in our country, there are a lot of city. If we want to go any place, any city, then uh, we can how we can go uh, in shortest path uh, in the one city to another city and then uh, oh, there are a lot of uh, like if i want to go uh, one city to another city there are a lot of path and a lot of route we have but uh, what are the shortest uh, route we can go and, uh, and and so that it will uh, take it will uh, take less time and uh, less cost to go one city to another city and then at that time we can uh, we can you apply mathematics in that uh, to go uh, one city to another city uh, like like one city if you want to like one city to another city there are there are different route to go one route uh, it might be uh, takes seven uh, 60 kilometer another route it might be take uh, 90 kilometer uh, to go that city and it cost will be different and this is this if we uh, know that the shortest path uh, then we, we can easily go uh, one city to another city uh, with uh, using mathematical calculation and uh, like uh, in in uh, like civil uh, in construction site and uh, if if anyone would like to uh, make any building then everything we need to uh, measure everything we need to uh, like 
like the to make the building we need brick and uh, sand cement road there are a lot of things then uh, we need to calculate how many like how many things uh, we uh, we need and like uh, how much uh, sand and how much cement we need uh, to uh, to uh, mix up with uh, so that uh, we can build uh, our uh, house uh, our home uh, building uh, if we make mistake to mix up uh, sand and uh, sand and um, cement in an appropriate way that that will be uh, dangerous to make a building uh, and i think yeah math all of the same all all right thank you so much so he was trying to um, make understand us about uh, mathematics in daily life you know they are uh, we are using maths in our daily life but we are not aware about it if you go for a shopping if you go for a training for football or cricket you may measure the ground so you know it is completely mathematics so um, if you measure the geometrical area or the the earth or anything if you are going to build a, a construct a building so everywhere mathematics is associated you know in shopping banking and budget you know budget and designing then calculation everywhere mathematics is compulsory but even though in our secondary or senior secondary or university teachers are teaching us different calculations which are not at all related to our daily life some calculations some mathematical terms are not at all using in our daily life so i am just greek about those kinds of uh, aspects you know uh, as far as i am concerned mathematics is greek to me so uh, some some of the formulas or equations are not required in our daily life so why our school syllabus or curriculum uh, Im impose us to learn those things to get mark in mathematics i don't know this question is really to to all of you this is my concern so next i would like to call upon mr bill to speak about this wonderful topic mathematics first you introduce yourself Oh, hello guys. How you doing? I hope you are doing great. Well, I have just entered the chat room, so I might be a bit lost. Um, so I'm from Brazil. And well, you are from very different countries. So I, I, I'm a little bit shy, shy. But well, nice to meet you guys. Um, well, I'm... I'm a current English teacher, but I've been studying civil engineering. So yeah, for me, when we were talking about constructions as the other guy was, Jason, Jay, Jay, I don't know how to pronounce your name, bro. <laughs> Jason, is that it? Jasim, Jasim Odin. Odin, all right. So <laughs> sorry for mispronouncing. Uh, well, it's everything for me because my profession, what I'm going to become a civil engineer is all about this. But yes, when you're talking about like we have a chronometer, like saying that the meeting is going to finish in six minutes or like music, we have like the time, the duration, the tempo of the music, you know, everything is around mathematics. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I am unprepared for this discussion. I just thank you, wanted thank to, you very that, much. That, that's my first time, you know. All right. Thank you very much for giving us a clue in, into a deeper <laughs> discussion. You know, mathematics is really uh, engaged or really incursed in uh, musical instruments. It is really associated with uh, musical instruments. There are guitar or violin or or any kind of math, uh, musical instruments, their mathematics is, uh, is associated with. So uh, if you are going for a music class or dance class, their 
mathematics is associated. So thank you, Mr. Bill from Brazil for joining us today. And please join our WhatsApp group if possible. And you know, the admins number is given in the link, Zoom link. So please check and just message to them and they'll add you to the group and you'll get that link every day on time. Next, yeah. moving on to... Just to explain, the biggest problem for me is the time zone because here in Brazil, it's 9 a.m. And yeah. during the most days I'm working or study, whatever. Okay. okay. Sorry for the interruption, Mr. Bill, because due to time limit, after four minutes, after exact four minutes, this meeting link will be disconnecting. So I request everyone, every respectful personalities here joined, please rejoin by clicking the same link when it is detaching, disconnecting. So next, let's invite Mr. Mr. Muhammad Salman. Are you available now? Are you okay to speak? Muhammad Salman, yes, yes, can you absolutely speak? Absolutely, I'm available. Am I All audible right. to you? You are perfectly audible. First of all, good evening, everybody here in India. The time is evening. So, because there are so many people, so they are from other countries, right? So, here is good evening. So, I wish good evening to everybody. So, yeah, this is Mohammed Salman. And uh, I have a job. So, I'm working somewhere. So, it is uh, Saturday today here in India. So, I'm on week off. I got this opportunity today to join you, you guys. You guys are wonderful, doing great job. And uh, I really appreciate it. So let me start. Yeah, mathematics, it plays an instrumental role in our life. Uh, you know, zero, zero, it was invented by one of our greatest scientists. The name is uh, of, the, of the scientist is Aryabhat, if I'm if I'm correct, right? You guys, guys who belong, belong to India, then you guys might notice that Aryabhat invented zero. So uh, it was that uh, I don't remember the. Your your voice here. is not clear. Your voice is not clear. We we need a crystal clear voice. Uh, your clarity in voices. A little bit uh, noisy so i don't know what is happening over there maybe due to your headsets so you please check your technical yeah, yeah. Let me, let me, allow me please, please let me check it so let's talk to another person during that time rao imtinan is are you available here mr yes, sir, rao Yes, sir. Mohammed Salman, Mohammed Salman, are you okay now? Can you continue? Or do you want time to check your microphone? Your mic is on, off, unfortunately. Yeah, is it okay now? I have done it because. Oh, okay, all right. Okay. I'll, I'll come back. Okay. I'm all sorry right. for that. I'll, I'll come back. Okay. So now, Rao Imtinan, you can start and you can deliver your, your views right, about mathematics. Right, sir. Hello, everyone. Hope all of you are fine. Uh, uh, today, our topic of discussion is math use of mathematics in our daily life. Mathematics uh, is a universal language. In all around the world, there are same roles in them like other language english french and they have different criteria to read right. and debate but math math is a math is a, a study about the shapes numbers and and uh, pattern in all our daily routine we know that when we go we check time many time there is all around about the math uh, math uh, in when we came in our health system is also helping our health like uh, scientists say about those people who are in, uh, who are able to solve the problem, mathematical problem, critical problem, 
दे आर आर मोर लॉजिकल देन अदर पीपल बिकॉज दे यूज ऑफ ओवर माइंड एंड वेन वी केम इन अ फाइनेंस सेक्टर हाउ टू मेक अ बजट वेन हाउ मच वी स्पेंड एंड हाउ मच वी सेव इज how this all we calculate with the help of mathematics because we use the number formulas is all about the mathematics and when is the also we manage our time our daily routine we spend uh, we make a time table with the help of mathematics in uh, when we 